Hello and welcome to one more episode of Ideas to the World. Enjoy your How progress is really like. This is a metaphor for life, for every aspect of your life. Even social evolution, personal evolution, relationship evolution, the world evolution, the evolution of everything you can see through the lens of this metaphor that I'm going to show you and present to you right now, which is the metaphor of the ice cube. Imagine an ice cube in a, in a room that is minus 10 degrees. Oh, it's cold, man. You are cold. I am cold. Minus 10 degrees. It's some fucking cold environment. Temperature. Okay, but with the ice cube, well, it's solid like a rock. Knock, knock. It doesn't, it doesn't go liquid. It's not going anywhere. It's okay. And let's turn up one degree with the air conditioner. One degree. Okay, how you feel? The same? Yeah, me too. And the ice cube? Yeah, the ice cube looks the same as well. No difference to anybody. Because it was just one degree, right? Okay, if we continue to going up in the degrees, eventually we go to minus one degree. And then we stop. Let's say we stop. And from minus one degree to zero, it's like what? The change. Like this. Instantly, when it goes to one to one or zero degrees, the ice cube melts instantly. And you are pretty different in your temperature compared to where you started to minus 10 degrees to one degree or to zero degrees, right? And this is the power of transformation. This is how transformation happens. It's never like this, right? We sometimes think it's this. It was this video. It was this friend. It was this, this partnership. It was this business. It was this deal. But in fact, if we take a more broader look, it was that, 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 man, minus one degree to zero, of course. And also on top of that, minus nine degrees that we came from, right? Because we were on minus 10 and then we increased nine degrees and then one more degree and then went to zero. And minus 10 from minus nine degrees, it is as important as minus one to zero degrees. So this is to tell that this is an excellent mindset to adopt while creating a habit or while seeing some or any type of transformation. That the first steps, the beginning, registering on the gym, learning how to do the, the physical exercises, buying the towel or the towel of going to the gym, preparing the bag to go into the gym, starting to see which types of foods I can look to replace into my current diet. All of these first steps that don't seem to give objective results at first, they are as important as when we are eating the healthy food. As important as when we go into the, the balance and we see that, well, I am 10 pounds lighter, 10, 10, 10 kilos lighter. Lighter. I hope I'm saying the, the, the names right. You guys help me with the English. I'm Portuguese from Portugal. Big help, big, big, uh, big heads up to Portuguese people. So it is as important the moment, the time, what that preceded, the big transformation, the big result, as what we did previously. Ronaldo, to do the big goals, is he needed to learn how to walk, how to stand up. So that's the same for anything that we look in our lives. This is an excellent mindset because you understand that things will not happen instantly from day to day. You have to put in the work, put in the work, pass through what I call the storms. So pass through the times that, that it is summer, that the times that is, well, raining and storms are coming. So everybody, everybody is freaking out and you have thunders you know hitting the trees close to you and we're like oh my god it seems impossible bro to survive but those days are the most important days okay but maybe that's a conversation for another video but this is to tell you that no matter the transformation you are going there are days that they will be sunny days that there will be more storms then it will seem impossible but that's all part of the journey in what i call the uptrend trajectory on the uptrend trajectory there will be places where it seems very hard Places that seems very easy and then hard and then more easy. Oh, this is more easy. 
Oh, this is more hard again. Oh my God, so hard. It seems like I didn't even run by one hour last week. Now I am running 10 and I want to go home. What the hell? And then you continue and it's more easy again. More, more easier again. And then more hard. And then you go on this up trajectory full of ups, ups and downs. But you are always better than one month before, one year before, even if you do not see it right now. I hope this gives you some perspective into the future. And if you want to work with me, links on the description. Thank you so much. And as always, good luck. Put the like, of course. Subscribe, activate the bell. This kind of stuff. This kind of stuff. Comment. Bye.